Good morning everyone. It is Monday the 31st. Welcome to a new vlog. I can't believe I'm already vlogging for the second week. I'm here at the gym. I'm just in the parking lot. Today I'm training with Teddy who is my trainer. We train once a week. We mostly do weight training because I am trying to increase my strength and to build muscle. So he helps me with that. And then the other days of the week I train by myself. I do a pretty good job but I feel I need help. I feel I need someone to push me. So that's why I train with Teddy. reconstructive treatment that really works the roots and helps to regenerate your hair it's really good for damaged hair and then I cut myself some well Caroline cut the, uh, the curtain bangs and and she uh, thank you <laughs> so Caroline cut some curtain bangs and she curled my hair and it looks and feels great Good morning everyone today is Tuesday and I think I'm taking the day off well not off but I want to stay at home I want to clean up my room because my studio is extremely filthy <laughs> I, um, I use that room to shove all my junk in but I think it's becoming a bit ridiculous so I'm gonna sort that out I also have a little bit of admin to do I need to buy groceries so it's just a day to sort things out I left you yesterday after my haircut so I went to the gym and then I had a haircut I didn't do too much after that but in fact I was editing last week's vlog and I uploaded it so if you haven't checked it out please do and now I'm gonna have some breakfast let me show you my breakfast and after breakfast I'm going straight into spring cleaning this is breakfast it's oats blueberries dates peanut butter honey chia seeds and here I have boiling water with a bit of apple cider vinegar. I am going to drink this and then I will make a coffee for myself. But for now I'm going to enjoy this. This is the room. So there's my ring light, my plant, my desk and most importantly my heater because this room is quite cold. And this is all of the junk we need to sort out. So this is actually a guest room. That's why I have beds. But I don't use the beds every day as you can see so I transformed it into my studio. Okay so let's start cleaning. Aside from tidying up I think I need to declutter because I have quite a bit that I don't need at the moment and I want to sell it on Yaga so I may do a little video where I show you everything and then you can find it all on Yaga because most of the items are brand new or gently worn. Everything is in good condition. I would never sell anything that's not in good condition or not almost brand new. Even if I've had it for like years, I probably wore it once, so it is still brand new. But yeah, I will have that video up soon, hopefully. But for now, I need to just clean up and sort all of this out. This is my perfume slash a few extras shelf. As you can see, I have some face masks. Some products here, what is this, oh, sunblock, peaceful sleep, just a few extras that I have. I have a whole lot of makeup pouches there and I'm not going to do too much here because it looks neat to me. This needs some work. This is my jewelry shelf and when I had a guest over I shoved everything in the cupboard as well as here and there. So I'm going to work on cleaning these. So with this 
pink box. I got this from Unilever. There was a beauty at home campaign. Um, I got a whole lot of products that was lying in this box, but I think I need to use it. I'm going to still use this box. I'm going to keep it and put all my other packaging in here because I have a few boxes that I could recycle and use when you guys purchase from my Yaga store. So yeah, I thought instead of just throwing it out and wasting, I can use it to package all of your orders and at least it will look presentable and I'm not wasting a box. So I'm going to keep this big pink box, take all the stuff out. In fact, I need body wash. So I'll probably use this one right here. This is the Luxe Botanicals Glowing Skin. This is my husband's friend's t-shirts. He made t-shirts with his face on it and for some reason it is lying in my cupboard. I don't really know what to do with it. I would love to give it away but I don't think I can because shame it's his money so I don't know. I'm gonna have to find a place to put it. Definitely not in my cupboard. This one was pretty neat as you can see. The cupboards are quite clean it's just that I had a guest over last week and I had to shove everything in the cupboard so I need to clean it out and I have a whole packet of beauty items. This whole packet of beauty items that I want to sort out because there are a few items that I know I'll definitely not use. I want to sell those because it's brand new. I've cleaned quite a bit. I've taken out quite a bit of makeup that I'm going to try to sell on my Aga store and now I'm tackling my makeup tray because I need some organization before I start creating new content. So this is what the situation looks like. There's a whole lot of stuff up there which I'm trying to clean. But this is the trolley. I'm busy doing all of this. This is where all my palettes stay. These are not all my palettes, but I have some of them in my makeup kit, so I don't want to take them out. This box has a whole lot of crystals and stuff just for when I want to be creative. And then just a few other items here that I want to clean and put back in my kit. This is a foundation, it's a Tom Ford foundation, traceless foundation. It's very light. It's nice, but it's very light. So it's for people who have perfect skin. Then I have the Smashbox Studio Skin, which is also quite lovely. I actually really like that one. An absolute fave is the Bobbi Brown Intensive Skin Serum Foundation. Another one that I really love. I didn't see it for such a long time, so I haven't been using it, but it is the By Terry Hyaluronic Hydra Foundation. Really like this one. Now that it's in front, I will use it. Then I have the MAC Studio Face and Body Foundation. This one is a color N2. This actually belongs in my kit because this is not my color. I actually don't have a lot of foundations anymore. I recently got this one, but I just need to check if it's my color. It's the S foundation. I saw someone else using it and it looked great. It's very light coverage also, but it looked great. So I'm going to try this out. I got a sample. I'm going to try the sample out first. If, if it doesn't work out, then I can exchange it for my color. <laughs> Be doing my eyebrows now as you can see they are not in the best condition they are quite untidy and Rashmi is going to do my eyebrows Hi. and she's going to tint them and make them look beautiful again is it today it's thursday oh my god so yesterday i didn't do anything i was just sitting at my computer and honestly i forgot to vlog but today i just went to do my eyebrows at rashmi as you can see they are a little dark but they're always dark on the first day after about a wash or two then it lightens and it's perfect mm, this is a henna dye so that's why it lightens with water but for now i know i look a little bit crazy i also have a pimple which is driving me crazy 
I feel like this week I'm not flourishing. I'm actually looking my worst. I don't feel great. And I think it's the cold, hey? I really do think it's the cold. I'm just like not in the mood for life. I just want to sleep. I don't want to dress up. I'm not flourishing and I'm not proud about it. I'm just feeling bad overall. But anyway, and now that I have my eyebrows done, <laughs> which look really strong, wow. <laughs> but it'll look great in a few days. So I'm very happy. I always do this. And the first day, I never ever show anyone my brows. It's quite intense. But um, after a few days, it's okay. Now I'm heading off to buy some groceries. I am fasting today. I would have loved to buy a coffee, but obviously that's not gonna happen. I'm gonna buy some groceries, go home and cook. I'm making potato and leek soup because it's super cold here in Joburg. And then I need to get back to work. I have a few things that I need to do for makeup school. So yeah, come along with me. Wanna be free of this heart. I wanna feel your arms around me I need you more, need you here More than I would like to admit Let's forget about tomorrow Yeah Should I hide away forever? Should I close my eyes and never again? Hold you tight, call you mine Think about you every time I remember that it's over, yeah You never break, you never lie You never ever scared of the dark So why am I the one who cries? I'm so afraid to be left behind I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop, yeah, yeah You never lose an argument So I've been trying hard to pretend I'm making a potato and leek soup. I look horrendous. And what the hell is on my face? Anyway, I am um, gonna go into the dark kitchen now. Hopefully there's enough light. I feel like I need to stand this way. So yeah, it's too cold, so I'm making a potato and leek soup. I got the recipe of onceuponachef.com. It's just some random recipe that I found. They have unsalted butter, leeks, potato. It's like the proper French one, but I'm gonna add some onion, maybe some chili flakes, cause you know, I'm Indian. And so let me start making this and then I can go and start my work cause I wanna do some stuff. I need to work on my portfolio and edit a few videos. I don't know if I wanna make a video today. I don't know, this is troubling me. I might, I might not, but uh, yeah, let me do this and then we can continue. That I'm okay, it's just a phase And everything is going just great I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop Yeah, yeah I always knew that this would happen Yeah You would find a new distraction I need you more, need you here More than I would like to admit we let go of tomorrow, yeah You never break, you never lie You never ever scared of the dark So why am I the one who cries? I'm so afraid to be left behind I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop, yeah, yeah You never lose an argument So I've been trying hard to pretend that I'm okay, it's just a phase And everything is going just great I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Hello everyone! It is Saturday, I just finished my makeup class Oh, the sun is so bad I just finished my makeup class and now I'm road tripping with my brother-in-law Say hello Salman Hello We are going to Zeres to meet Suhail We're gonna Oh, I'm just filling up petrol. We are going to support Sahel at the comedy show. Come to the water where you will find peace. 
take a step into the river Get down on your knees Come to the mountain We'll take it in the view You will find that life is Greater than you knew When you go through the storm It's after the show and we're home, so let me show you the home. It's a little bit dirty, but what can I do? Broken and you shattered at the point of no return. You pick up the pieces and you let the bridges burn. So come to the water, you're sailing with the breeze. Take a step into the river Where you will find peace Where you go through the storm I will hold you, keep you warm Where you stay in the night I will shelter, I will fight Out in the felt with Mustafa, we're doing a little photo shoot as well as doing some target practice. When you go through the storm, I will hold you, keep you warm. When you stay in the night, I will shelter, I will fight, I will So come to the water 